we're still in creepy tale Ingrid peasant Pe Ingrid peasants yep that's that's what it is now this I can feel my life force being sucked away by playing this game I swear we've done this exact thing before all right I see the owl faces with like keys or something in them I don't know what they do okay I guess I have a skull now with a worm that I've now broken and what the hell did I just get another metal object I never figured out what it was I got from that other room from the upper floor oh no it was the scissors that's what it was I, has this already been fucked by be, because I did this and as soon as I put this in he's gonna he's gonna see me and be like yo you're in trouble or he'll just immediately turn around very conveniently okay Okay, so now I can go... What am I grabbing there? I don't know what I grabbed. Could you please... Why do I have... Why do I have an ancient sickle? Why is that a thing I need? Not for good reasons, I'm sure. Okay, so I now have to... Alright, I've already triggered this upper area, so what I need to do... He doesn't seem to care about the second bookcase near him, he only cares about the far one. So I need to place... Yeah, I know. You're unimpressed. Alright, now he's going to turn around, right? If I place this, he'll fuck off. Then I come, grab this one, I go up, then I go back across and down behind him and pull the other one. I think I have to... No, because if I pull this one, it's going to seal me in with him. So, okay. Oh, or he'll decide it's time to turn around, I guess, this time. I have to do the whole thing again. Fuck me. Alright, put that in, go across the bridge, smash the spooky skull again for no reason, instead of just putting a key on the shelf like we easily could have, it's gonna make it weird. I'm sure that larva thing won't come back to haunt us in any way. So now... I think I can place this one back, right, no fuck off, and I pull this one, go around behind him, then go all the way across and up, or down and then up rather, because I still have one key in inventory. 
And then I think I have to backtrack. Well, that's not good. Um, so, what happens when I get this one? Okay, it gives you the full, full way, no, halfway across. I need another key to pull that off. Is there, I can't even go back. I can't go back down. I guess I go up and see where that gets me. Is that going to pop me out at the top of one of the other ones? Or a random reading room? What's that prickly mass? That's what I dragged myself up here for? I guess that's what the sickle is for. I somehow... Oh, this game and its logic. And it wasn't even about a book. It was about an orb. So now this question remains, how do I get down? If I pull this key, it's just going to retract those things again, right? And if I pull the one behind him, he's going to I'm going to be trapped in there with him. Oh no. Oh, okay. Well, please don't make me do this whole thing again. What the heck was I supposed to do? You're kidding me. Over one mistake? Really? That was your that was your solution? I get to keep the sickle, though. But not the orb or the key. <laughs> so did I do it wrong? I don't see another way. I'm trying to think if there's like, so. In theory, to solve this, it would appear I would need to have two keys with me as soon as I'm going up the second, the ladder on the far left. Otherwise, I will get up there and not be able to place enough keys. Uh, to get all the way across the other orb, which I presume I need both. Um, if I raise this, he's going to come to this one. Let's just try something. I'm going to pull that one and this one. And maybe he ignores the second one being up if I just disable the one he's inspecting. And then can I sneak behind him? But I still don't have two keys. Wait, no. Hold on. If I go up, I retrieve this key because I no longer need it in theory. Now I have three. And as long as he doesn't turn around, or he does turn around and not in the way that sees me, then I will have two keys. Was I supposed to read the book? Maybe that's part of the answer. I didn't even see that. in. Why, now the interaction prompt that I didn't see before is stuck. Okay, let's do it again. This is very tedious. 
And I can't skip this animation or anything. Can't skip anything. Okay. Up. And... Cross... Down. Get his attention. Up. Across. Down. Oh, wait a minute. Wait, how many keys do I have right now? I have one. But I don't need... I still don't need this key don't think anymore at least for right now right now I'm fine so let's take it with me and hope that it's not a self-sabotage the problem is how do I get across well I can't make heads or tails of any of that that's not helpful um, I now have two keys Which means I can open both of these gates, but... Is it enough? Am I screwed? Well, I no longer have to jump down and make the noise. So this is already cut. But I still have to go retrieve it again. Why is this, why is it making me do the whole thing again? Come on. All right, now I use the other key on this other owl mouth, which frankly look spooky and or questionable. Um, okay. But I can't retrieve any of these keys And I need one. Do I have to fucking stab the guy? Because I'm pretty sure... I don't... If I grab these this key, he's going to notice me. And... If I grab either of these, I'm locking myself... Oh, wait a minute. Wait, no, because if I drop... I need to be able to cross this way. If I drop, he's going to see me. Oh, no, wait a minute. Wait, wait, no, because I can't pull the key down there. I was going to say, if I can lock him in, then... Then he can't come get me. I'm I'm pretty sure if I jump down it's just gonna be the end of the the run, so I need to find some, figure something else out. I just don't know what it is. Can't go back up this way. Can't use anything on him. Is there anywhere else for me to hide? I 
So here's the, here's the conundrum, right? If I pull it out here, he's going to notice me. If I go up and pull one of the other keys and try and drop down the, the far left ladder, he's going to notice me and catch me before I can use that key to go back over the top. I, I don't understand. There are only three keys in this room, right? I'm not missing an interaction somewhere? And if I go down, it's one way as well. There's nothing else to interact with in here. No. I feel like I've seen all these outcomes, or a version of all these outcomes already. How is this not going to... If I drop, he catches me. I think I have to go down there and use the other, grab the one down there and hope, hope I can beat him somehow? Oh, he didn't turn around this time. Then what the, oh, I just meant I had, wow, um, Not, not appreciating this. I'm glad I was wrong, and I'm glad that I figured it out instead of do, trying to do it ten more times the wrong, weird way. Uh, but I, I still hate this. These puzzles make me feel insane. And so does him playing with his creepy belly button and singing a little song to himself. Anyway, I'll see you guys in the next episode.